Right now in Manhattan, kind of quiet. 30 degrees doesn't seem too bad. The wind is west at about 10 to 15. That too not bad, and people are out and about as we get ready for a huge shopping day, uh, buying groceries, a lot of baking going on today too. And there's a look at downtown where we're dark until roughly 6.45 to 7 o'clock, and we'll brighten it up after that. So 32 degrees doesn't sound bad for late November. The wind at 15 to 25 on occasion, not the 30, 40 to 50 mile per hour wind we had earlier. So the wind advisory in the western counties, that was canceled before 3 o'clock, but it's still holding on up here toward St. Joe and Atchison. The winter storm warning that we had over parts of Nebraska, that has shifted off toward the northeast. And the high wind warning that we had from Topeka and Lawrence East, well, that's still holding on in Kansas City, but really for our viewing area, no advisories, no watches, and no warnings. So we're in really good shape here with a clearing sky, good road conditions, great visibility. It's just chilly and breezy, so be aware of that. Nothing on radar until tomorrow morning, so all day and all night we're dry. There's the departing storm. The farther away it gets, the more the air relaxes. We're also getting the back edge of the clouds to work their way through, so it's improving as we go each and every hour today, and we'll have lots of sunshine. Lighter winds out toward Fort Riley, Ogden, Junction City, and Chapman, but still going 15 to 25 in the central and eastern areas. At times, Augusta 30 or 35 still, and you might know Notice that some decorations that were set out are kind of toppled over. Uh, so you might have to do just a little bit of cleanup. Might be a trash can down the street, too. Uh, but otherwise, I think we're okay. And wind chills are in the teens and the 20s, so you've got that to worry with. 15 in Garden City, the snow getting cleaned up in Goodland, and the road trying to improve as we speak. Denver, one above after being at zero last hour. So there's the departing storm impacting Chicago, Milwaukee with strong wind, snow in areas of Wisconsin, Minnesota. But here comes the next one, and that one's going to come sweeping out of the Four Corners area. So our sunshine today will get lost as we get into tomorrow. A lot of cloud cover. And early morning, there's going to be some snow and some wintry mix. Might be slick spots between, say, 5 a.m. and 10 a.m., and then it goes to wintry mix and rain through the day. Road conditions certainly improved by then. And then we're looking at some cloud cover early Friday morning, but then the developing rain. You might get lucky, though, if you're out really late Thursday night or early Friday morning with just clouds. So we'll go through the 40s today and try to get to 42 or 44. And then overnight, we'll have the clouds on the increase really late, but kind of frosty in 29. But then snow might be a dusting to an inch. Then some freezing rain, then some mixed rain snow, and a high of 38. Rainy periods, but warmer on Friday, but it looks pretty wet. And then Saturday looks good, cold wind on Sunday, and great weather next week. We'll try to warm it up a touch. We'll have loads of sunshine each day, and we try to get several days in the 50s as far as a bigger accumulating snow. I don't see that happening for at least 7 to 10 days.